Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, a game that we've been looking forward to for a while. Definitely a different spin on the Star Wars franchise, considering the fact that the only recent Star Wars games we've had were like the Star Wars Battlefront franchise, which leaves something to be desired in my opinion. So, a game where it's going to be narrative-based, focused on, you know, one character going through an actual like combat exploration RPG elements. It's going to be a lot of fun, I get the feeling. So, I hope you guys are excited. So, look at this. So, here's what you got. Story mode. Players who want to focus pretty much only on the story and a minimal amount of combat challenge. Look at that parry timing bar. Then low damage and low aggression. Jedi Knight, which is normal mode. Parry timing is kind of generous. Incoming damage a little bit on the high, uh, higher up. Then you got Jedi Master. So basically play people who have played these games before. And then you got Jedi Grand Master where parries are like ridiculously tough, right? Ridiculously tough. I'm gonna go with what was the default, Jedi Knight, okay? <clears throat> well, then again, maybe not. It actually says, you're new to melee action games and desire a forgiving combat challenge. You know what? I might go with Jedi Master. I think I'm actually gonna go to Jedi Master. I do. I think, I think it makes more sense because this sounds too easy to me from what they're explaining. I think I'll go for the one that everything's right down the middle. All right, I'm gonna do it. I think that... I, I agree with all of you that, that that makes sense. People in the stream chat are saying I should go with that. Yeah, I definitely uh, I definitely believe that that's what I should do. So we're going to go with Jedi Master, okay? Thank you, Alfred Aponte, for a dollar tip. He says, uh, hope you're, you're good, man. Waiting for Star Wars. Uh, thanks always for uh, giving us good content. Very nice. ATS318 actually tipped me $5. It says, it's like this holiday season is going to be a lot of fun for the stream. I agree. Uh, not only are we going to be continuing on with various new game playthroughs, but there's a lot of stuff that I haven't gotten around to that should be fun, that we'll be wrap, we'll be, be, I finally have a chance to do. And I got a holiday event coming up, so there's a lot of fun stuff coming up for the holiday season. Thank you, guys. <clears throat> Mr. Bubba Veris, I missed when Bioware were making Star Wars games. That was a long time ago. Knights of the Old Republic, right? All right, so we got what appears to be a Star Destroyer. Classic Star Wars, uh, you know, scene with the Star Destroyer flying over you. Ah. What the hell is that? Star Wars blues song, it sounds like. Oh no, oh no. So just for the record, all these guys are independent contractors. They're not Listen, working for the Alliance a or count, the Empire. The boss wants a word. It's gonna be good for us. Here he is, Chief. An error has been detected on line 10A. All our clamps are jammed. I need two workers to climb up and secure the cables. That's not an easy maneuver. The guild will double your pay for this shift. Double your now, pay? Well, it's a score. Huh? That couldn't hurt. Huh? Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Get to work. This way. I'm right behind you. <clears throat> okay. There we are. Some open movement. You jump pretty high for a human. If he is human, I mean, he looks human. Okay, you dodge with circle. Wow, the dodge is great. He jumps right off the edge and kills himself. Oh, I didn't know you could actually do that. That's kind of weird. <laughs> That's kind of weird. You can jump right off the first ledge and kill yourself. Uh, you can't dodge off the ledge, but you can jump off the ledge. Okay, then. What other controls do we have? Square does nothing. Uh, triangle does nothing. None of the shoulder buttons do anything. So right now, all we have is jump and dodge and roll. So you can do dodge and double tap. That's when you roll. Okay. Cool. Uh, Frenolich is in a 3,000-bit cheer. Holy crap. He says, fuck yeah, Star Wars. I'm so worried you were, you were baby man gaming today with Pokemon for the mainstream. Take my bits with you, you big lug. No, it's going to be Star Wars, and I'm even challenging myself by doing the... What is it, Jedi Master level? Instead of the normal level that I would just do, like, uh... 
you know, kind of the easy mode difficulty, I'm doing a, a, a higher level of difficulty because it seems that the other one's way too easy. So, thank you very much, Fredolin. It's a very generous cheer. Okay. The graphics are good. That was so good, Obogado, as he said. So good, Obogado. Oops. Oh, there's a ramp over here. Cutting into my wages. You gotta take on more jobs. You can't just sit here collecting a paycheck. Cut. You're a rigger. What if I screw up? Take a fall. I got a family to worry about. They're having little conversations. Family? Oh, friend. You've made some poor life choices. Ha! Tell me about it. Rigger should not have a family. Don't worry about it. Spend money if you're dead. You know, it's true with all the ginormous. Up here. With all the ginormous ships and contraptions and things they have in the Star Wars universe, being a mechanic must be like an insanely tough uh, job. Whoa, look at this. That's a cool view, man. The ship breaking yard on Braca. A separatist ship. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. All right, let's go. It's cool. <sighs> All right, well. What the hell? <laughs> Someone took me five dollars called Notorious Nazi Phil. Well, I'm not gonna read the comment, but I'll just acknowledge the five dollar tip from Notorious Nazi Phil. Of course, as you know, I'm a notorious Nazi. Everyone knows this. It's, it's docu well documented. How about Cavalier did a hundred bit cheers? Says use the Schwartz. I, I hate it when my Schwartz gets all twisted. It's the worst, man. Up. Whoa! The barrel hey, full okay? almost killed him. Yeah, I'm good. Ladder's out though. I'm gonna have to find another way. This way. No problem. I'll improvise. Whee! Uh, this is cool. Depart this barge immediately. You are not approved, trash. <laughs> trash. It's not approved trash. Oh, don't talk about yourself like that, bro. What's his name, Cal? Don't dish yourself, Cal. Some Tarzan rope swinging, very nice. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what he said. Easy there. Just passing through. Uh, can I climb this? Yes, L2 it says. This is an interesting game mechanic. Climbing mesh walls. Hurry up. We're close to finishing ahead of schedule. I can just about taste the credits. Huh? It's gonna be a wild night tonight. Let's get this job done. Uh what do I do now? I need to get up to that platform somehow. Oh! Oh, dude, it's like Uncharted. It's totally like Uncharted, where you can grab colored patches. I didn't realize that. Now, what is that? Is that a, is that a health meter that I see in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen, I guess? Okay. Reckless cow. Good to see you. You too. Get yourself killed. That's the idea. To look at this, they're trying to basically rebuild a star destroyer, I guess, that got completely wrecked. See, they're rebuilding the thing from the ground up. Pretty crazy. What's cool is you never get to see this side of Star Wars. You never see the people actually building the stuff or fit repairing the stuff, right? This is kind of neat. Okay. 
Sounds like scrap rats. Creepy. Just passing through, guys. No need to come out and say hi this time. He get all the way up there. The Sounds good. Be there soon. Jay Bullard says it feels like Tomb Raider climbing controls. I would say so. Tomb Raider or Uncharted. And uh, Sub Zero Cool says, "Oh, excuse me." Uh, or 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 Junaja says, "Atmosphere seems pretty good." I agree. And then Sub Zero Cool says they're scrapping the Venator for parts. Oh yeah, so they're actually scrapping this destroyed, uh, you know, Empire ship for parts. All right, Flip Smelly Chair cheered. He said, I can't change the direction of the wind, but I can adjust my sails to always reach my destination. Fair enough, I guess. Um, Drink Piss Not Poop cheered, asking me what's my favorite Star Wars movie. Um, Probably either the original or Return of the Jedi. One of those two. <clears throat> well, no, not Return of the Jedi. Empire Strikes Back. I do like Return of the Jedi, too. A lot of people don't like it. I like Return of the Jedi as well. But I think everyone agrees, like, Empire Strikes Back is one of the best, if not the best. I just like the original trilogy over any of the more here? modern movies. How'd you get here? Huh? Ugh. Okay. Wah! Ugh. Yeah, it's definitely like Uncharted or Tomb Raider. Now, how do I get up there? Looks like I gotta go around. Yeah, gotta go around. I guess I couldn't get high up enough right now. Oh, more sliding. Look, the ship cutter is here. There it goes. Ship cutter? Look at this thing. Hey, we should get moving. Yep, good looking out. So they got a giant cutting mechanism that can cut wings right off the ships and stuff. That's cool. Yeah, this is pretty neat. I don't think I've ever played a Star Wars game that shows the behind-the-scenes stuff, right? No, oh, can't go that way. So which way am I? Am I going this way? I don't know which way to go now. I don't think I can climb any of this stuff. Oh, I'm climbing this thing. I thought this was just part of the, the scenery. Huh. So here we go. Today there's some kind of a stupid new meme about peanuts. Don't ask me what the hell it's about. It's not, I, I have nothing to do with it. Some dumb meme about peanuts going on today. <laughs> Is my camera covering everything? Not that I can see. Looks like my camera's not covering anything yet. Maybe there, it will be later, so... The turd says Ray did this job on a smaller scale. Cutting this wing. Action A, action A. I'm working as fast as I can. I guess, but we didn't really get to see Ray do much of it until the, the action of the movie picked up. Look at that view. So look at this. This is basically a junkyard. Look, they got all the walkers. They've got all kinds of like destroyed Empire vehicles and stuff that they're cutting apart for scrap. It's pretty crazy. What I'm to understand, this game takes place after the events of Revenge of the Sith, but before the original Star Wars trilogy. That's apparently when this game takes place. Cal, use the manual override lever below. R3, pull. You got it. Your turn. Okay. Ugh. Hold on. All right. Clamp secured. Whoa. Uh. Okay. Still here. Uh. Give me a fright there, pal. Done. There's a hell of a way to get I to where this. you need to go to just do some basic work. Uh. We're done. Get out up here. 
Come take a look at this. It's a Jedi fighter. What a score! It's a real scrapper's payday. Uh, I mean, this thing's been here, what, four years? Five. <laughs> Never flew this, but down in a place of glory. Those Jedi. A real tragedy. I've always said they couldn't all be traitors. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I guess it's just our lucky day. Empire's gonna get a lot of good material out of it. Yeah, here we are, scrapping these ships from the war, just so they can turn around and make new ones. We're racking, huh? All of us risking our necks for the bosses. No look. And the pay was better back during the Republic, too. Hey, you really should watch what you say. Listen to me. Find us free like this? It'll be your ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you're a young guy. You don't end up like me. <sighs> Eventually, you gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Whatever you say, hey, we should get back down. You're not listening to me, though. Oh, who's that? Oh no! That's a work-related accident! Contact the insurance adjuster quickly! Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Whoa! Whoa! Ow! Look at that freaking... What the fuck? The giant creature! Now! I, I can't climb up! Crap! Just hang on! Help! Save me! Ah, oh, shit. Don't let go! Save him! I, I can't hold on! Crap! No! He's a, he's a Jedi! Nice! Oh, God, he's still got hurt. I'm alright! Just pin down! Pilot's gone! I'll get us out of here. Just hang on. Watch out! Oh shit. Oh my god. Look out! Look at this fucking thing. Giant creature. This thing is barely flying. Hold on! Phew. Made it. Thank you to Voxy for a subscription. Thank you, Voxy. Okay, we gotta... We gotta move. Come on. Uh, hell happened? Uh, Cable snapped. What was that back there? Was, it, was that you? <clears throat> what, that, that was the force, wasn't it? Just forget what you saw, okay? Please, no, trust no. me. I've seen them. I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. There's Pro bounties out on people I like know. you. I know. I know. Yeah, we're ready. We need to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. And watch what you say, man. They work for the Empire. You can't be talking about people using the Force and shit, right? Well, thank you very much, Friendolith, for an $80 tip. He says, I'm super stoked for the Fallen Order playthrough. There will be deaths, so remember, Jedi can feel the Force flowing through them. The Force is what gives a Jedi his power. Stretch out your feelings. With your feelings, the Force will be with you always. You thank you, Friendolith. <clears throat> Good. Yeah, you? Yeah. Kel. I've been working with you some time now. I've never seen you do anything like that before. It's a secret. We've been through some hell together. <laughs> so, I know the risk that you took for me. <clears throat> I just, I don't know how to repay you. Don't mention it. I mean it. Oh, you don't have to worry about me. This place, it's not safe. up on the Mount Shadella. Yeah. You won't be seeing me for a while, bro. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, Kel. Hmm. That's kind of silly. Just because he used the Force once, he's afraid that someone's going to have seen it and, and call him out as one of the remaining Jedi. Because remember, in Revenge of the Sith, 
they exterminated the Jedi. That they, they were deemed as outlaws. And so they were all exterminated, and he's one of the remaining ones. He's considered an outlaw. So that's why he has to, uh... <clears throat> you know, <clears throat> try to escape. So he looks like he's been undercover for years and years as someone working for the Empire's scrap team. But now he's got to figure out, now that he used the Force, oh man, I got to escape because I'm going to get, you know, caught. So, interesting. <clears throat> Prof? Where did he go? He sold him out already. He immediately sold him out. The graphics are quite good. Prof, they do really good, up. man. Visit you said execute order 66. Is that the order to kill all Jedi? I think so. Well, they're all disappearing. What the fuck? Alright, this is definitely a vision, or he's asleep. People just disappear. Where are you going? <laughs> this totally isn't creepy. There's something wrong with this door. Now, normally in a game like this, you would turn around and something would startle you or shock you. But I have a, a method to beat this. You ready? In any game like this where this is going to happen, here's what you do. Ready? Look. Ha 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 ha! Whoa! <clears throat> you just walk backwards and then this is a jump scare. It never gets you. That could actually completely glitch games, too. Like, there's supposed to be a jump scare behind you. If you don't turn around, you won't get jump scared. <clears throat> so anyway, oh my god, we're like on a, an Empire ship now, right? She out to CM Fool. It took me $3 to play the quiet man. Oh my god. Well, thank you, CM Fool. <laughs> thank you for the $3 tip, CM Fool. Oops. All right. So obviously this is some kind of a vision he's having. This is not really happening at this point. <clears throat> All Empire ships have moving walls, you didn't know. Oh god, that's right, the Empire Alarm sounds like a, a, a broken horn. <clears throat> oh, hello. Whoa, this guy's got force powers. Mark well and listen. Master. Trust only in the Force. Huh. Weird. Train has stopped. Yeah. Something's going on. <clears throat> Hello. Everybody up. Identification ready. Move out and line up. Probably just another contraband inspection. Nice red visors. Must be a special outfit. Shout out to nothing but a fan who be up for five months. Yes, second sister. Second sister? Who the we hell is this? a dangerous fugitive. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. 
Turn yourself in, or everyone present shall face summary execution. How the hell were they on to it? I think it's time someone came forward. I, uh, I've been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. We refit and rebuilt ships. Best in the galaxy. Then came the Empire. <laughs> and engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. Prof. We all know her. the truth. <clears throat> We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire. We're all just expendable. Yes. You all. Yep. <gasps> no! Yes. You knew that was gonna happen. Look at this. A lightsaber. <clears throat> I found the Jedi! What's that? Checking out the disturbance. Oh, that hurts. <sighs> Hold it. Don't move. How'd you get here? Easy now. Got a stowaway. Hey, you don't need to call this in. That's right. Quiet. You don't need to. This is TK-8190. Repeat. Did you say Jedi? Copy that. I've got the traitor here. Okay. Jedi. <laughs> I was what happened if you waited? Well, I waited a long time, nothing happened. I thought maybe more of you guys would show up or something. Nothing happened at all. Okay. Still got the dot, nothing else? Oh, oh, wait a minute. Holy shit. You block with L1. L2 is nothing. R1 looks like a force ability, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Or grab? I'm not sure. The triangle still doesn't do anything, though. Oh, shit. There's more guys over here. Okay, hold on. Rob tipped me $15. He says, hey, dude, what's up, Rob? Good to see you today. Thank you for the tip. And Yoda tipped me a dollar. He says, patience you must have, my young Badawan. All right, thank you, Yoda. So 16 more dollars in tips. Thank you guys very much. But you better. <laughs> Alright, here we go. You hear that over the comm? Jedi? Stay sharp. They won't get past us. The traitor, blast them! Can anyone hit him? Lock those blaster bullets. Not an easy target! Shoot that Jedi! What the fuck? Come on, cowards! Your force meter is empty. Damage enemies to regain force. Okay, even before it hits, reflected blast. It's not possible. Watch yourselves. Nice. That's not possible. Something you just did it three times. <laughs> Cargo door. Oh my god! <laughs> All right, that's pretty awesome. Admittedly, that's pretty awesome. Soundtrack's great. I'm 
I chose to rest instead. That's how target I lock. That's Switch how you targets. For okay, death. just like Dark Souls. When your enemy located. Does not look good. I knew it would end like this. You did? Yeah! You knew a Jedi would slaughter you? That's pretty amazing. Hurry, get him! Look at this animation. Nice. Oh yeah. Very nice. There's another one. Okay, stamina decreases when you block. Harry. Yeah. Oh. Beautiful. Slow an enemy with R1. Ah, okay. Blows them down. There's your force meter at the bottom of the screen. Use the force on object with a blue outline, okay. How did that help exactly? I don't know. Oh, you climb it, I see. Aha! You get health back. They haven't introduced it yet. Get to the front. Stop the train. There's gonna be some guys oh, no. here. Oh shit! Need cover. Whoa. Gotta move them between bursts. Now. That was fucking brutal. Dude, that was totally brutal. He's like, fuck that. Da, 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 da. Filled him with holes. God damn, dude. Filled him with goddamn holes. Ouch. To 
Well, I put it on the hard difficulty. As you can see, he takes a lot of damage on hard difficulty. What's that hole doing there? Why is there a hole? Oh my god, he slaughtered him. Whoa! He shot the coupling out. Yes, he did. Gotta get down. This is pretty cool. It's got good action sequences. It's like a charty. You know? I like this. Oh, no, no. oh shit. On the train that's all wrecked. Only way is up. Of course, no good way. The only way is up. Thank you, Alfred Aponte, for two dollars. I appreciate that. <laughs> Uncharted in space, yeah, pretty much. Uncharted with Jedi powers, pretty neat. Calamity Cal. We had Calamity Drake, Calamity uh, Croft, and now we got Calamity Cal, where everything just blows up around him for the sake of exciting set pieces. Here we go. Oh, you can deflect it into other people. Oh, that's cool, dude. I thought you could only deflect it into your original target. No, you can deflect it into other people, too. But now. <clears throat> Train stuff? Are you surprised? <laughs> this what the uh -oh. this can't be good shit right the train Whoa. holy crap Bitch. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you had some training after all. Who's your master? Padawan? 
someone I killed, perhaps? Sir. What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? You yeah. bleed like all the others. Sequence, I like it. That was fun. Okay, shut that thing off and the grab some seat. Breeze. Thanks for the help. But who are you people? My name is Sir Junda, and this is my captain, Grease Dritus. How you doing? Yeah, the man is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So, <clears throat> who are you? Cal. Kestis. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? And why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? And what's the bounty on Jedi these days, anyway? <laughs> That's gratitude for you. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. Like what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. You too. Anybody else? Oh, we're not good enough for you? <laughs> the Jedi <clears throat> Council. <clears throat> Well, technically they're not all gone. A few of them survived like Yoda, but they were basically all Captain, exiled and hiding. Set a course for Bagano. <clears throat> In the meantime, try and relax. Go, you're safe. For now. Hmm. Thank you to Jack Spartacus for a ten dollar tip. He says, Jedi Knight you are. Jedi Knight you are. <laughs> Hiding on Dagoba, I am. Move on and live your life. Bother me, you shall not. Find your destiny. <laughs> Cal -cal! <clears throat> you were talking in your sleep. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
demands it. A ginger you are. Red is your hair. Freckled is your face. <laughs> A pathetic Jedi you are. Ways of the Force you must learn. Oh, weirdly I talk. With inflection and backwards I speak. Ah, oh, look. Some nice uh, dinnerware here. Some fruit. Why not have some fruit? How about some coffee? A coffee maker? What is that? What the fuck is that? That looks disgusting. Whatever that thing is on the right. You got any coffee? Maybe some orange juice? What are those? What kind of weird space fruits? Space fruit juice. You're growing some plants. That's nice, I guess. Whoa, this thing popped in. What's this? R3 to interact. What the hell is that? A guitar? <laughs> it's guitar you must play. Artistic you are. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, God. Oh, boy. Ah, artsy fartsy coward you are. <laughs> what is this? Why is he playing the guitar? Terrible that is. That's that so rocket hard. you must stop. I wrote it. <laughs> I wrote it. Terrible. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's Ron Weasley. It's <laughs> echo it is. It's Weasley. Not many Jedi have that skill. Weasley's become a Jedi. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No. But I knew your master, Jarrod DePaul. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but... My connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. Hmm. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. You're not alone. Not anymore. You are not I'm alone. Come up with destination. Well, we, we hit, we're here at White Castle. How many uh, chicken rings do you guys want? Bogano. I like how they still do the screen wipe. The screen wipe effect from the classic Star Wars movie. They still use it. They go, whoop. This is Bagana. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. That's so, why it's such a shithole, huh? What's the plan? Are you Where's the closest Starbucks? I really need one, man. I need to get my morning We're baby up. We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really Damn sure straight. I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. Who is May it? May the Force be with you. Who is it? It's Greedo. Before he shot first. God, there's gonna be so many Star Wars references and puns. <clears throat> Guess I'm looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, why does Sierra need me? Sierra? Her name is Sierra. Even though her name is spelled C E R E, it's pronounced completely differently. Oh, look, there's cool creatures bouncing around. And they flew to the thing. <laughs> They literally flew into the, like, the fucking cliff and died or whatever. They committed suicide. So it says... Touchpad does nothing, by the way. It just makes a weird sound. What is that weird sound my touchpad makes? Listen. Okay. How do I use a skill point? I guess I can't use a skill point yet? I want to customize my poncho, can I? I have the jacket... 
or the Bracca Scrapper. I guess we'll stay with the jacket and say, yeah, I guess I can't use the skill point yet. <clears throat> okay. Ooh, what the hell is that? Shh, be quiet. Let's see if I can sneak up on it. Ready? Hello. Hello, little furry woodland creature. What would happen? Oh, shit. Hold on, let me back up. Look away for a second, see if it comes back. No, they don't come back, huh? Scared them off. They're these little ground burrows or something. Oh, it's the music. Oh, oh, there's some more. Hold on. I can't slow them. <clears throat> they go right into their burrows. Okay. Mr. So Papa Vera cheered. He said, be very, very quiet. I'm hunting wabbits. What's this? Circle? No. Oh, R3. Meditate. Save point. Save points are located throughout Cal's journey. Be sure to interact with them to save your progress. Save points are where Cal and can rest and spend skill points to acquire new skills. Okay. So you you have enough skill points to learn a new skill. Open the skill tree. All right. Cactus God Reese for five months, fourteen total. So I'm enjoying the game so far. I chose the hardest difficulty. It's tough. Enjoy the game. I'm on next hardest. So. All right. So you have to learn this new ability called the Overhead Smash. A powerful strike that is deadly against weaker enemies. Triangle. <clears throat> okay. Damn, he shot his head right off, dude. He didn't die. This thing he chopped his head off, though. That's fucked up. Okay. We know how to overhead smash. Or is it slash? I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> No, what the hell? Hey, BD1. It's Rob. I'm Cal. Uh, Rob yeah, the Robot. Okay. I'm the just 1980s. I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. It's a Jedi robot. You, you know the Jedi? <clears throat> what do you know? Wait, hold on. Hello, Yoshi, all over. Thanks. Yeah, I think the game looks great, too. I agree. So, climb the vines. La 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 la. That's the vault Zeer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. The hell's this? New objective added to your hollow map. <clears throat> Reach the vault. Okay. Current objectives can always be seen on BD1's hollow map. Look at that. That's neat. Try experimenting with the hollow map controls. Okay. Hollow map also shows unexplored pathways and important landmarks. All right. <clears throat> Close the hollow map with circle. What's this way? I sense something over here. Boop, beep, boop. Boop, whoop. Oops, shoot the whoop. Something down here, enemies. That's a really big bug. That's a really dead bug. Ow! Damn, that's pretty disgusting. Quite honestly. <clears throat> Look at this, like a wall jump or something? Oh shit. 
Oh shit, I'm stuck down here. There's a wall jump or something you need to do. What's that? Oh! You fucker! What was that? Sense an echo. It was after boggling eggs and the pack fought back. Data bank updated a dead splocks. Through a rear ability known as psycho psychometry, Calcum receives information from the force when he touches certain items. Okay. No way through here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. But it looks like if you wall jump, which I don't think you can do right now. Yeah, if you have a wall jump ability, you should be able to like jump back and forth between these, I think. But I don't think I can do that right now. There must be a new ability you need later. <clears throat> looks like it anyway. <clears throat> okay. Okay, going back. How do we do this? BD1 is busy. I want to look at the map and it wouldn't show it to me. BD1 is busy. They won't show me the hollow after dicks. Yeah, they won't show it to me. <laughs> Dude, they still won't show it to me. Yeah, look. Well, that's stupid. They won't show me the map with a bunch of dicks. <laughs> 